today's episode, we will look at the Ferrari 250 LM, which is an amazing race car by Ferrari that won at Le Mans in 1964. And it is kind of overshadowed by the Ferrari 250 GTO, uh, which is the world's most expensive car. And um, I think it's an amazing car, uh, definitely one of the coolest classic Ferraris of all time. It was unveiled in the 1963 Paris Motor Show, and the ones we're talking about are mostly from 1964 to 1966, while there are other model years, just that these are the most popular. And it was designed by Pinin Farina, and they make some of the best looking cars in the world, such as the Ferrari F40, and they definitely made this car just stand out from the rest, and it has absolutely amazing styling, as you can see right here. It had a 3.3 liter naturally aspirated V12 and it sounded absolutely amazing. It was a rear wheel drive and it had a five second zero to 60, which is pretty fast for a car from back then. It expected to be a little bit longer. Um, also, it was built in Maranello, Italy, and only 33 were made. It had a five speed manual transmission and its engine could rev up to 7,500 RPMs, which is pretty good even today. And also, it was a proper two-seater supercar slash sports car, whatever you want to call it. Had 320 brake horsepower, and the most amazing thing about it is that it only weighed 1,808 pounds, which is barely anything even for today's hypercars and supercars. <laughs> top speed of about 180 miles per hour which you could argue if that's good or bad but if you're um, in a race car like this you're mostly going to be taking corners more than just going straight and also it had 203 uh, pound feet of torque at 5.7 pounds per horsepower and since these things are classic Ferrari they're ultimate collector's items with some selling of upwards of 44 million dollars and 17 million dollars depending on which model year what do you guys think of this road and track ferrari i think that is a very cool and also comment if you guys have any cool video ideas for this series or any other series in general and also uh we're trying to hit 100 subscribers by the end of the year so it'd be really nice if you guys could subscribe i definitely think it's possible and we will be doing our 80 subscriber special uh in our next video so make sure to watch out for that <laughs>